Thanks for the 2000 for this invitation and this opportunity, and thanks present. It's hard to say what I wish for my country in a few minutes. However, I have half of my job fighting for it. Four years ago, my brother, deputy of the National Assembly, Juan Recasens, had the opportunity to be invited to this forum. Today, he is a victim of saint reality he reported in 2014. My brother, Juan Recasens, has been kidnapped by the regime for two months. That's why, if you ask me what I wish for my country, I cannot want anything other than democracy. For me, democracy today means having a full home, having my brother coming home and seeing his two children grow, grow up. Means not having to see my friend running out through the borders. For me, democracy means that our universities could be places of investigation, academy and debate, without being afraid of being closed or economically suffocated. For me, democracy represents the opportunity to give life to those who are dying today, to give freedom to those who are behind bars. For me, democracy is even above my life. The representative democracy established in our constitution is not being respected. Majors like David Smolansky today are in exile, and deputies like Juan Recasens are imprisoned today for speaking up his mind. The world knows that us, Venezuelans, have fought for democracy. I swear we have. My generation, youth and student sector can't find in other countries opportunities for progress. This is why we decide to fight for democracy. Because we refuse to see more people dying on the street. More people eating from the trash. Doctors and professors starving because their salary is less than a dollar and teachers raising children from the ground who have fainted because they have not eaten in days. Today, I ask you as a student, leading of the most important university in the country, the Central University of Venezuela, on behalf of all Venezuelan youth and the student movement, on behalf of all those who have had to flee from Venezuela, as a sister, as a daughter, as a Venezuelan, please do not leave us. Here we are representative of various organizations and institutions that today fight for human rights, for justice, for freedom and democracy. I ask you to assume a commitment to look for the means to support the Venezuelan youth that today continues fighting not to surrender despite the fear, despite of the frustration, despite of the hunger, despite of going through the worst crisis in the history of our country. The youngest, the students, all of us, we decide not to give up. Why do I wish for my country? Justice for our brothers killed in protest, like Juan Pernalete, Neomar Lander, Carlos Moreno, Fabian Urbina, heroes of my generation. I wish freedom for the more than 250 political prisoners, like Leopoldo Lopez, Manuel Chacin, my brother, Juan Recasens, who today are behind bars of thinking differently. I want the next generations do not have to live what today we have to live, and this could only be possible in democracy. Today, yo me niego a rendirme. I refuse to surrender. Thank you so much. Thank you.